Welcome to my class. I'm teacher Maricar of Angeles Elementary School. Today, you will learn another lesson in math. You will learn how to round off numbers to nearest tens, hundreds, and thousands. I have here a story problem. I will be reading it for you. Suppose it takes you 22 minutes to get home from school. Would you say it, it takes you about 20 minutes or about 30 minutes to get there? How do you round off numbers? Why is it important to know about rounding off numbers? Rounding off is making a number simpler but keeping its value close to what it was. Result is less accurate but easier to use. You can make estimates when you need to know about how many or how much. To round off numbers, we simply follow these rules. First, look for the digit to be rounded off. Second, check the digit to its right. If it's 4 and below, round it down or retain the digit. If it is 5 or above, round it up or add 1 to the digit. Change all the digits to the right of the digit to be rounded up to 0. For example, round up 54 to the nearest tens. 5 is found on tens place. This is the digit to be rounded off. 4 is the next number to its right. Since 4 is less than 5, then 54 rounded off to the nearest tens is 50. We simply copy number 5, then turns the number to its right into zero. Let's try another example. Round off to the nearest hundreds, 861. 8 is on hundreds place. This is the number to be rounded off. Next number to its right is number 6. Since 6 is more than 5, then 861 rounded off to the nearest hundreds is 900. We add 1 to number 8 since 6 is more than 5, then turns all the numbers to the right into zeros. Let us try the last example. Round off. 5,825 to the nearest thousands. 5 is on thousands place. This is the number to be rounded off. Next to it is number 8. Since 8 is more than 5, then 5,825 rounded off to the nearest thousands is 6 thousands. We add 1 to number 5 and turns all the numbers to its right into 0. Let us try to round off the following to the nearest tens. Can you help me? Let us start. The first one is 239. Round off to the nearest tens. We have... 240. Next, we have 882. We have 880. 556. Very good. We have 560. 
How about the last one? We have 454. Very good. It's 450. Let's try to round up the following number to the hundreds place. We have 1,393. Round up to the nearest hundreds, we will have 1,400. 8,823, when round off to the nearest hundreds, we will get 8,800. If we have 1,526 and round it off to the nearest hundreds, we will get 1,500. Lastly, if we have 4,589, when rounded off to the nearest hundreds, it will give us 4,600. This time, let's try to round off the following to the nearest thousands. We have 1,393 rounded off to the nearest thousands will give us 1,000. 8,823 will give us 9,000. If we round off 1,526 to the nearest thousands, it will give us 2,000. Lastly, if we have 4,389 rounded off to the nearest thousands, it will give us very good 4,000. I want you to remember the following. To round off a number to its specific place, locate the place value of the digit to be rounded off. Then look at the next digit to its right. If the digit to its right is 0, 1, 2, 3, or 4, retain the digit to be rounded off and replace the digits to its right with zeros. If the digit to its right is 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9, add 1 to the digit to be rounded off and replace all the digits to its right with zeros. I hope you learned something from me today. Thank you for watching kids. See you again.